first lady is great, right there. She has to, and she wanted to go. Can't fly for one month. The doctors say but she had a big operation. That was a close to a four-hour operation, and uh, she's doing great. Right there. And you know what? She is a great first lady. The reality is, um, is that you know this procedure or operation. Um, known as an embolization that can take several hours to do successfully and I guess the length of the procedure is a little bit arbitrary too. Are we talking about the time that she went back for the procedure to the time that her family or loved ones saw her again or are we talking about the actual procedure time is a little bit still in question. So um, in general embolizations of the kidney for procedures like this can take an hour or two, um, but it really does d depend on the the operator who's doing it and the complexity of the specific tumor that the that the patient has. So it's really hard to to gauge based on that information. And I think that really the crux of all of this um, that we're all sort of scrutinizing and speculating about and why there was a increase in the length of stay at the hospital and why she had a perhaps a bit of a longer procedure than others may be really due to the fact that it's simply a matter of who she is and perhaps that extra bit of caution because she's a you know very important person and and you know they wanted to make sure that all their I's are dotted and T's are crossed and they were doing that so I think that that's it if I were to guess that would probably be the reason for you know these a bit of an abnormal length of stay, a bit of an abnormal duration of a procedure. In general, I would say that they are a bit out of the ordinary. Um, I would most people who undergo an embolization procedure for um, a kidney kidney abnormality would probably go home the day after the procedure, or perhaps even the same day, depending on what the situation is. Um, also, again, not being able to travel for four weeks may be a little bit abnormal too. But I really think that. Um, the reason for that abnormality and why she stayed in the hospital longer, why she's been given this prolonged period where she can't fly, probably more likely stems from the fact of who she is and the additional you know, degree of cautiousness that her doctors are, are utilizing in her case more so than anything else.